Hello, everybody. This is Pahamar. And this is Direwolf20. And this is episode 28 of Material Energy Hypercubed. Pahamar. I fix things. This room is very red. That is because this is actually the reds. Oh, the actual reds. This is the one and only reds. Apparently the Sweet. other one that we played was the tormented. Oh, well that's cool. I think it's because the yeah. map updated several times since we started the series, so dimensions yeah. changed and stuff. Yeah. Anyway, it's fixed now, and I also fixed the overworld, but we'll see that later. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll have to visit the overworld, because I think we should properly clear out the reds. I feel like that's a thing to do. So I can take care of these enemies if you want, if you want to start lighting the place up. Says the man who's, like, already hurting. I'm not hurting that badly. I'm surviving. So, uh, yeah, you did a good job fixing this, Bahamar. I am a very good person at copying and pasting. Copying and pasting files can be hard. Oh, wow, okay, so that's a fall. You all right? Um, I do have my angel wings. So, pro tip. The space yeah. under that platform is hollow. Awesome. Are you like somewhere that I can drop you angel wings or? Um, I got my staff of traveling, so I'm like not really that bad off. And these mobs really okay. can't hurt me that bad. Like it's just the normal mobs that spawn when it's dark. So, so far, no terribleness, which is not on par for. Oh, geez, you just both got shot in the face. Up. These two skeletons are shooting each other. <laughs> that seems to be a thing um, that skeletons would do. Yeah, they're jerks. And how? So I'm... I'm wondering, like, you know, where's the catch in this area? Because so far this seems, like, almost too easy. You notice the layout is kind of familiar? Uh, a little bit. So there's red and black stained glass in this chest down here, and there's a book that says help. What's in the book? Read the book. Read the book. All right, I'm going to read the book. Are you ready? Read the book. Page one of seven, help. Book, book, book. Page two of seven, help. Page three of seven, help. Page four of seven, help. Page five of seven, help. Page six of seven, help. And page seven of seven, help. What do you think they're trying to say? I'm, I'm not sure. Part of me thinks he might want help. Oh, there's a core log in here, too. Oh. It's a book. Page one of three, analyzing core. Error, 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 error. Running self-repair, self walls missing. Replace space-time walls. Didn't down. we already read that book? Tessellation error. Tesseract invalid operation. Fluffy unicorn was here. I found a thing. What's the thing do? Well, it's not really a thing so much as it's a place. What's a place? Uh, a place is a... That's a very hard thing to describe. It's a location in the world, I guess. Wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's a hole it real. down here. Like, if you go underneath the ME controller is set up, like there's a hallway that you can follow. Okay. That's where I'm at currently. I assume that you're still up there poking around. Is there anything exciting up there or interesting? Uh, not that I see. Like, I wonder if there's anything in this network. So I'm kind of interested in going back and like grabbing a crafting terminal or something. Yeah, it's probably doable. I'm just lighting up the area down here. There's a big bunch of stone. Which is very atypical for this area, so I'm kind of interested in what's up there. I find it funny that rather than use the wireless, I always just come back to the base still. Well, you know what? It's force of habit at that point, right? I'm, I'm still waiting for something to jump out of the sides of the walls here and yell boo. Because, like, this isn't hard yet. 
and I'm, I'm not quite sure what I'm missing, but I feel like I'm missing something. I'm just flying around. Yeah, no, there's like nothing going on here. Dun 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 dun. You find anything interesting up there? Nope, nothing yet. Okay. So I'm down yeah, where I'm you down where... were. Yep. There was nothing in the terminal. You? What's that? Do you have a hammer on you? Like a hammer hammer or a crescent hammer? Hammer hammer. I do. All right, there's some smooth stone back here. That's the only thing I can see that's, like, not normal. Up there, you mean? Up here. There's some up there, too. Yeah. I okay. agree. Okay. So there's smooth stone above us. That's the only thing I can see that's, like, jumping out at me as weird. Oh, silverfish. Well, that's not good. Yeah, so the hammer doesn't work on this stuff. Oh, well, that's less than ideal. This is going to get old really fast. Do you want to focus on breaking blocks and I'll fake focus on killing silverfish? Okay. You're real good at this. Well, I'm trying not to hit you. I feel like that would be the opposite of helping. Maybe I should have the wings. Um, maybe, but you dig even slower when you have wings on. Yeah, but let's see, you get to the point where I can't reach. I'm up here now. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Um so Clearing large swaths of terrain in one fell swoop. Because um, we even have, like, super haste on our pickaxes, right? And, like, it's still taking a long time to break this stuff? Yep. Uh, I have an idea. Explosives? Explosives. Uh, yes. Okay, so there's nothing below us. Fair enough. Okay, I've got TNT ready. Okay. Do you know what you're doing? I mean, I have a rough idea, but no. I remember that TNT turns into a falling entity when you light it, so I'm pretty proud of myself right there for putting that piece of cobblestone down, but... And this is where the sight comes in handy. Are you invisible or something, or...? Nope. Nope. Oh, what are you doing? I'm trying to be sneaky. I kind of feel like that mostly worked. It's a good source of experience. The other thing is that, like, they fall, and haha, -ha, I don't. Thanks for explosions. Oh, you're quite welcome. More incoming. Well, what are you doing in there? I was trying to find a sneaky way up. And oh, now yeah, you're no, like, oh, come on, dude. <laughs> that's probably well, there's not gonna so work for you. many. <laughs> And they're all on fire! Well, they are now, because I'm hitting them with my sight. 
I should upgrade this thing. What, what kind of upgrades are on this available? Um, effective durability. How about the not speed. throw Pahamar into a wave of silverfish upgrade? That sounds like a really boring upgrade, if I'm going to be totally honest with you. You are like... This you're like a planetary dust cloud forming into a planet of experience. Yeah, of experience. <laughs> there is quite a bit of it. And a lot of ectoplasm. Nice. Um... I got one of them. I think the other one's despawned. Cool. I got a silverfish of uh, a silverfish trophy. If that helps. Is that I think like you got it the honest way, as opposed to just finding it as a secret. Yeah, but there's no secret available for completion, so maybe you already found it, or there is no silverfish one. Nah, we already completed that quest. Well, so, yeah, I, I don't know if you agree, but I'm going to continue exploding TNT. Do we happen to know if the Skystone chest is um, explosion resistant? I want to say that it is, yes. I'm getting a lot of gas tears from these things. Really? That's a that's a weird thing for silverfish to drop. Oh, it's silver nuggets. That's what it is. Well, I found I found the wall. The wall. Yeah, like the wall from like the laboratory wall. Oh yeah, that's that's a boring thing to find. Yeah. Um I'm being attacked by ghost silverfish. That's that's probably a thing that's happening. I would wager that we're like severely impairing the ability for the server to function at this point. Yeah, I'm gonna re-log in. Which is taking a long time. Okay. You long may time. have spawned too many, silverfish. Spawned too many silverfish. There's no such thing as too many silverfish. In the, that we're unable to use the game, yes there is. There is. Okay, well I'll kill some. If it makes you feel better. As, as soon as the game recognizes the fact that I'm hitting them with a weapon and the server catches up to that knowledge, I will have another planetary orb of experience. Should we come back once we've uh, resolved the silverfish situation? I think so, because you've just spawned way too many. Okay, cool. Well, Mr. Pyomar, this was a nightmare of a thing to do. It appears that it required copious amounts of TNT, and, well, you can see how high our experience is right now. We've already dumped it a few yeah. times. Yeah, like the levels of things that needed to be done were rather insane. And annoying. I think we got our, um, this seems too easy. Well, yeah, like I knew it, right? Like there was nothing happening, right? Like it was just a few vanilla mobs. There was no like thousands of wolves and there was no thousands of this and that. Like, yeah, it no, seemed I'm... too easy to me. Yeah, I've fallen down here because I'm dealing with some of the lighting areas, but I'm pretty sure people saw earlier on that we managed to find ourselves. Was that you exploding something? Yeah, just a creeper. I'm killing Enderman because okay. that's one of the quests that we actually haven't completed yet is killing Enderman. Yeah, they just don't hang around long enough. Yeah, they're not fans of being there. But yes, after much hunting and exploring, we found this thing. Hey, look, Pahamar, I found the Red's Wool. Woot. Would you like to have the honors of placing it on the platform? Sure. So just so everyone's clear, last episode we cheated the reward because we thought the red zone was busted. We didn't realize yes. this was the correct red zone, so we've already received yeah, we thought the it reward. Was broken, and it was kind of broken because it was the wrong dimension ID. Exactly. So I will go place this in the Victory Monument because now we've done this the Yay. honest way. Yeah, we did. And by honest way, I mean that we blew everything up. With TNT and Wither Splash Potions. Which worked very well against mass hordes of silverfish. I've lost my quest book. Oh. I want to make sure I get the order right. Okay. So this is after Ice Wool. There we go. There we go. We're still missing Reason. the ocean wool. I don't know where that ended up, but we did get that. Did we get it? 
Yeah, we did, because that's the only way we could have gotten to the wolves area. Remember the idea machine full of wolves? Yeah. You don't remember it all, do you? Uh, I remember the wolves. Ocean wool was, yeah, okay. Yeah, beats me. All right, I'm going to go dump my experience because I've got a lot of it. Got a lot of it. Yeah, me too. I don't even know if we have enough like inventory space to dump it all. Well, this is a pretty big tank. Yeah, but once you get into, like, I have up to 50 levels. I don't know what you're at. I'm at, I was at 54, 53, 54. Yeah, I'm going to wager that you're still going to be in, like, the 30s or 40s. Dun, 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 dun. That's cool. I'll dump that later. I have gear to fix. Why do I have the wrong skin? Do you have my skin? I do. I'm a Steve. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, so we completed the reds. It wasn't that bad, but the silverfish were awful. Thank you, Parcel. That was rude. That was great. We beat it. It was terrible. Yeah, we hate you. Stop being that. I'm just trying to figure out how much uh, I've got left in terms of upgrade points available on this scythe. I wonder if I can upgrade it with more with more stuff. So, did you fix the overworld too? Does that mean we can go there and check that whole questline out? I fixed quest line the out? overworld. Nice. You, sir, are a champion. I am just a system admin. Just a lowly system admin. Uh, block of quartz. Excellent. I'm gonna upgrade this scythe so that it has like crazy amounts of damage and that'll be fun for me you want to come back in a minute after we've uh, repaired our gear and done some things sounds good okay guys we're right back all right bottom our rumor is that we are out of eulorium you'd be correct not anymore all fixed indeed you have fixed it yay So, uh, I believe you had a plan. Yes, my plan was because we managed to get the overworld working. And by we, I mean me. Yes, all you, 100%. Indeed. That world did nothing. So my thought was, is because we kind of, there was a couple quests that involved going to locations in the overworld. And yes. And we didn't really do it honestly. Correct. So the things. Oh, like we Mar went to the locations honestly. We just... We didn't see what didn't they wanted see us to see. So my thought yeah, was that I would reset the little progress little on them so that we could do it again. Because they okay. didn't really give us anything rewards-wise. Like, we don't really need the rewards now. Correct. So I'm just going to get me the cheaty book. Okay. And I'm thinking... Okay, so I have fixed that. Okay. So now if you look in the quest book, you should see Marble Mountain is blinking and the other one's done. And the Iskandar Wool one, I can't stop its availability, but... Okay. We know that we got to do Marble Mountain and then the, uh, I think it was a Magic Cave. Sweet. So like I said, the I think I told you offline, I didn't say it on camera yet, but the other thing I noticed is when we get to the overworld, um, there is a portal back here, but it doesn't take us doesn't back mean. here, back here. All right, well, we can always teleport back here if we need to, because we're supposed to be able to get back here. Yeah, it appears to be another bug. I'm using the latest version of the overworld, so this pack is still 104. So right. we'll just we'll do that. I don't think there's any cheatiness involved in that. Yeah, because we're supposed to be able to get back here, but we'll see. Um, so you just went to the deep dark? Yep, and you still got to do the logout thing. Okay, so let's come back after we make it to the overworld. But I'm already there. Oh. You're just slower than I am. I, I'm a, Well, I was waiting for you to go. Well, I'm here, and I'm waiting for you. Okay. Cool. I, too, am here, and I am now... Ooh, this platform's nice. Yeah, see, I told you there was supposed to be a thing with stuff. Look, there's lots of cobblestone. Yeah, sextuple compressed cobblestone. Don't we need an octuple? 
Uh, no, we need an octuple compressed cookie. Oh, what, what, what would an octuple com a compressed cobblestone get us? Um, bedrockium. Okay, we don't need that then. All right. No. All right. So this portal should lead us back to the end. You're but saying it doesn't? It takes us to the end, just not to the observatory or anything in that space. It just drops us like right around the zero coordinates, the origin coordinates of the end. Okay, so I'm going to go back to Lost in Time, and I can see Marble Mountain is a quest 1314 by 824. All right, so it's northeast. Correct. You with your fancy wings. Yeah, man. Somebody told me, by the way, that they got wings in a reward bag, and I'm like, you are a jerk. That would probably be a legendary reward bag. It feels kind of probably. weird to actually like be playing a hardcore questing map with you, and like we're in the overworld. Yeah, like just a normal terrain gen overworld. I mean, I, I'm not finding like normal cows and stuff, but like there's grass and dirt and stuff. Right. Eight twenty-four. All right, I see a mountain that's very marbleish. And the Y level is 146. Oh, yep, I can yeah. kind of see that. Oh, yeah, look at this. So I'm here, and I'm claiming that reward. Is there anything which got to see me a legendary bag. Ooh, it's got a liquid XP bedrockium drum. We could have used this in the past. We could have, and we still can. Because you know how much that bedrockium drum stores, right? Yeah, it's an obscene amount. 65,000 buckets. You coming or what? Come on, man. I'm working on it. Use your wand of teleporting. Shift right click. See how cool that is? Oh, there is something up here. Yeah. I'm I'm assuming we're meant to go down. Is it water at the bottom? Uh it is not. Then I'm not meant to go down. Um it is marble at the bottom. Let me see what I can do for you, sir, based on what I have on my inventory at the moment. I got a miniature green heart. Sweet. Um, there's dark and terrible things in here. Um, it's snowing up here. Yeah. It's dark down here. What Y level are you at? I'm at Y level 56. Hey. If you want us to dig, I mean... Yeah, that's sure. what I'm doing. I was going to look for like a water source or something, but I don't even have a bucket on me. Have you... It's very dark down here, though. So, like, bad guys ahoy. Are you still, like, underground? Yes. Um, I'm going to look in the quest book to see where we're supposed to go. From okay. Here. Oh, there's some kind of, like, structure here. Found water. Oh, did you uncomplete that quest, Magic Cave of Iskander? Yep. Because it already completed. Is this the Magic Cave? I don't think so. I thought it was further away than this. Would you dig down one? One? Yeah. Like, anywhere, or...? Like, just where you see me below you? Yeah. There we go. I managed to fall down here with my staff of travel. That works. So this is pretty cool. Yeah, this is like an actually really large area. It kind of goes on, like, a lot. <laughs> um, can you quest book uncomplete that quest, the Magic Cave of Iskander thing? Where'd you go? 
below you, apparently. Okay. I think I found the bottom of this. Oh? Did you go down again? No, I mean, like, I, I'm down one more layer, but, like, there's not much more to it. Okay. Yeah, it looks like there's just, like, generic ores and such down here. Oh, there you are. I see you. It's awfully dark down here, Bahamar. It is. So, the, this is the general area where this cave is. Yeah. There's some Endearium blocks. Yeah, and it's up a Why little Why aren't there bit. any octuple compressed cookies down here? All right, what's this structure here? Gold block, okay. Nothing particularly fancy. It just kind of goes on for a long time. Yeah, but I think this is leading us to the cave. Is it? Did you uncomplete that quest? I did, so it's, so it's 1301 okay. and 635. Yeah, so yeah this, this is, is correct. Yeah, and the Y level on that thing, though, wasn't that deep, was it? 43, so actually yeah, a little 43. too deep. Would you like to come back after we finished mining our way into this path? Sure. sure. Oh, wait, no, I just broke through the wall. Where are you? I'm digging my way up to Y43. Oh, okay. Okay, that is a lot of quartz in the ceiling. Yeah, there's a lot of emerald here. And a lot of dense And a lot of mithril. Yeah, charged quartz too. Dense charged quartz. Lots of emerald. Alright, so we won't come back because I'm happy with where we're at right now. Okay, next up is Iskandar wool. So oh, did we just probably... complete... Where yeah, because we this is the this is the magical cave. Cool. So there's got to be wool in here somewhere. Oh, dense lapis. Yeah, this I am is, following Pahamar. This is definitely leading us. Dense iron. Yep. Dense copper. Skeletons. We're just like MLG Pro. Dense redstone. Which is... Dense Yalorium. Now we're starting to go back up. Back up. I wish I had wings like you. Yeah, that would be nice. Man, this cave's got everything we could need. It really does. Except cookies. And wool. Well. This is sulfur. There's a chicken. Like a yellow chicken? Yeah. Oh, stained glass. Here, Pahamar, I made a ladder for you so you can climb up to it. You're so sweet. Thanks. Piskindor wool! Nice. That's what's up. And that gets us a breach seed and a reward bag. Neat. What's a breach seed do? I don't know. I need to drop stuff in my knapsack. I'm going to see what's in my reward bag. I got a dark helm. With respiration, aqua affinity, unbreaking, and XP boost. Nice. And projectile protection. Uh, Multum. I got a bunch of bedrock and barrels. Medesium, sanguinite. Energized glowstone, aluminum brass. Oh, that's actually kind of nice. Pokefenium and I was hoping you would get manganese. Wings. Nope, no wings. And a breach seed, universal seed, growth. Okay. So let's see. Now we need to go to the deep dark. We, yeah, really? we need to go to the deep dark. 
We are in the wrong dimension. We are in the wrong dimension. Um, do you have your deep dark portal on you? I don't. It's in the AE system. Hmm. So maybe we should head back to the observatory, or at least to the world spawn area for this base. And yeah, we got to go back to that. Okay, so that's a long hike for me, and that's a short flight for you. I ain't that short. Says the man with wings. Yep. All right, we'll come back in a minute once we make it out there. Why? So in our flight back, we discovered that it is sadly that wrapping up time. It is wrapping up point. I'm sorry to say. Um, but we made progress today, and I guess we have to head over the deep dark. The blood moon is rising. I don't like the sound of that. I don't want a blood moon. Why? That, Why is there a blood moon? I don't know. Blood moon makes me think of blood magic, but there's no blood magic here. No. No, there is not. I managed to make my way outside. Well, that's good. So if the, and I'm near the entry to the quartz mountain. Did we ever record what uh, coordinates were the start of the world? We did not. I know that it was northeast. Oh, I fell. Right, so I'm heading southwest at the moment. I don't know about you, but so, the yeah. entire world is, like, red. Yes, it is. And the moon is red. This is no good. I don't like any part of what's happening right now. It's really dark, too. Mm. Oh, I think I see the place with the things. I wish I'd... I wish I brought one of those things that would teleport me to you. Yeah. Uh, you're looking for 1,000 on the X and 1,000 on the Z. Okay, that's not actually that far away. I just need to get out of this mountain. Well, staff of traveling. I'm going to have to dig through it. I'm, like, in the ground, dude. Stuff of traveling. Anyway, I think we'll come back next episode, Pahamar, and see what kind of troubles we can get into. I get the feeling. It's I'm not sure how I feel about this red moon thing, but none of it's good. Yeah, this is yeah. not a good feeling. Nope. I think it's just causing lots of monsters to spawn. That feels like it would be accurate. Yeah. Anyway, guys, for now, Pahamar and Direwolf signing off. Hope you enjoyed the episode. We'll be back next time. Uh, I'd like to try and go back to the observatory. We'll try the portal, and then if it doesn't work, we can just teleport ourselves, because like I said, it's supposed to allow us to just teleport back. So um, we'll see what happens. And then uh, we'll head to the deep dark and continue up what might be the last line of quests for us, Pahamar. I don't know what we're going to do about the octuple compressed cookie and the Torches of Time quest series, because like we're not even close to getting an Octuple Compressed Cookie. We have like one Septuple at this point. Yeah, that's going to be a ways off. Yeah, we'll have to figure out like if we're even going to do it, to be honest with you. I I'm, I'm, might just say, like, eh. You're not in a yeah. make-work kind of mood? I don't know. Maybe I'll... If I come up with a good way to do it off-camera, like, maybe I will, but I think at this point it's just, like, take what I've built and duplicated a hundred times and that just sounds boring I might but maybe i'll just be do it if I'm bored one day what i might actually be getting out from this mountain sweet i'm trying to guard this uh platform all right guys tony and pahamar taking off take it easy bye